Welcome to a second video taking a look at changing the subject to the formula. Um, what I suggest you do is you watch, if you haven't watched the first video already, uh, do that before watching this one. What I suggest you do with this video is you pause it and attempt the questions first and then press play to see the solutions. So here, uh, first one we've got is make D the subject to the formula. So to make D the subject to the formula, I'm going to need to get rid of this uh, multiply by pi. To get rid of multiplying by pi, I'm going to have to divide by pi. So dividing by pi, that gives me c over pi is equal to d. Next one, I've got y equals x minus 7. I'm looking to make x the subject to the formula. So in order to do that, I'm going to need to get rid of that minus 7 by adding 7. What I end up with is y plus 7 is equal to x. Third one, I've got express x in terms of y. Here I've got 6x plus 3y is equal to 4x minus y. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of um, I'm looking to try to get all of my x on one side, all of my y's on the other. So first off, let's get rid of this 4x on this side. That plus 4x on this side is in the way. We're trying to get all of our x over here. So we don't want x's there. So to get rid of it, I'm going to subtract 4x. That leaves me with 2x. Add 3y. Is equal to negative y. So now I can see that I've got this 2x here, but I've also got plus 3y. I want to get rid of that plus 3y. So to get rid of plus 3y, I'm going to have to subtract 3y. That's going to leave me with um, 2x is equal to minus y subtract 3y. So that leaves me with minus 4y. And then I've got this 2x is equal to negative 4y. I want to get rid of the 2. So 2 multiplied by x. To get rid of that, I'm going to have to divide by 2. That will get rid of the multiplied by 2. And so what I'm left with is x is equal to negative 4y divided by 2. And then I could simplify this by saying x is equal to minus 4y divided by 2 minus 4y divided by 2 is just going to give us a negative 2y ok um, last one, express x in terms of y y is equal to 3x plus 2 divided by 5 first thing that I want to do is I want to get rid of divide by 5 in order to do that I'm going to have to multiply by 5 so that leaves me with 5y is equal to 3x plus 2 Then I'm going to have to get rid of the plus 2. I'm going to have to get rid of the plus 2 by subtracting 2. So that leaves me with 5y subtract 2 is equal to 3x. Then at this point, I've got this 3x on its own. I want to try and get it so that I've just got x by itself. I'm trying to express x in terms of y, make x the subject. So I'm going to have to, to get rid of that, multiply by 3, x multiplied by 3, I'm going to have to divide by 3, and so that leaves me with 5y minus 2 over 3 is equal to x.